Okay, so um, over a period of about four days, this has had, um, I would say probably six or seven coats of Crimson Guitars finishing oil. Um, it's important that you dry it off completely between coats, um, otherwise it will just stay sticky and uh, it will never dry properly. It, if you get to the point where it, it is still sticky, you haven't wiped it off enough, if you apply another coat, give it a good rub in and then, then rub that one off completely, and I mean completely, until it's bone dry. Um, so that's the stage that we're at at the moment. This has had, like I say, about six or seven coats, plus the original, what it had before. I can't remember how much I put on it before, but um, I think we took some of that off uh, when, we, when we cleaned it with white spirit, uh, because there's white spirit in this, so uh, white spirit will take it off. So that's plenty of protection. The next stage is we're going to polish it with this. This is Renaissance Wax, micro crystalline wax polish, blended to a formula used by the British Museum. So um, I have it on good authority that this is good stuff, at least for nine, nine quid for that, which what in the US is about, what, 15, 16 US dollars That's a lot of money, but um, it is full right up to the top, which is uh, good And it smells lovely. So uh, So that's the next job. We're gonna uh, wax it Okay um, Lint free cloth is what you want. So um, I've got an, an old t-shirt that I've cut up Now the instructions say apply sparingly with soft cloth and buff gently. Right, so uh, I'll make a nice little, uh, little pad and we'll give it a go. Pretty good shine. Right, I think that's about where we're going to get with that. I can still see a few finger marks from the uh, from the finishing oil, but hopefully, 
once you get a build up of wax, they'll disappear. In fact, I don't think they're finger marks at all, they're uh, just where the wood's a bit uneven. I don't know if the camera can pick the, the shine up on that, but uh, it's not glossy, but it's not, you know, matte. That's just about where you want, really. So uh, I'm going to do the other side and then do the edges and then bolt it back together. Oh, puffed out. See you later. <laughs>